Good morning, everybody, and happy Friday. I'm Jordan Markoff. I'm going to be recapping your top stories for the day today. So one of the first things we are following is the Columbia chapter of the NAACP. They are responding to the Supreme Court's decision to end affirmative action. Officials with the branch are doubling down on their firm commitment to addressing the realities faced by people of color. This statement reads in part, the branch recognizes that race undeniably shapes and identifies in the quality of life for people of color. Despite progress made, racial disparities persist within our society, leaving lasting wounds that must be acknowledged and addressed. The Supreme Court's recent decisions have, played, have displayed what the branch refers to as a willful ignorance of these realities, end quote. Yesterday, the Supreme Court ruled that affirmative action admission policies are unconstitutional. The Columbia NAACP branch says colleges and universities must commit to diversity no matter what. Now, another story we are following today. A former mayor of West Columbia has died. That is Bobby Horton. He died at the age of 87. Horton served as mayor from 2004 to 2011, and then again from 2015 to 2019. He was also a member of city council from 1977 to 1989. Officials remember Horton as an integral part of building the Lake Murray treatment facility in the late 80s, which made West Columbia the largest wholesale water provider in Lexington County. He also advocated for the extension of the Riverwalk Park from the Gervais Street Bridge to Moffett Street in West Columbia. The West Columbia Riverwalk, of course, is vital to the city and brings in thousands of tourists each year. Well, thank you for joining us for your top stories of the day. Remember, you can always keep in touch with what we are doing on our website. That is WISTV.com. Have a great day. I remember that the world is so much bigger than that with Trilogy because one dose a day helps keep my asthma